Colbert Speed Recovery Finish Network. All right, got another one for you. Quick, cheap, $100 paint job. I'm gonna do a quick one today. Very mild primer work on the hood. Had a boatload of chipping and rust specs and stuff like that. We got it as clean as possible. We're actually not even gonna be sealing the car because the rest of the car, condition of the body was in really good shape. Just needed to be sanded and freshened up because it was faded, had a couple scratches, stuff like that. Not a lot of stuff going on. I've been getting a lot of criticism on these paint jobs. A lot of people simply think, oh, how do you do a paint job for $100? There's no way you can do it for that. Fact of the matter is, yes, if you are me and you're getting materials for the price I'm getting them for, which all of you guys can get them for, you can make it happen. We got the speeder coat. SMR 1150, 65 bucks a kit. We're gonna use about a quart of base and then reduce it and make two quarts of base. That's all we're gonna need to cover this car. So that's about 25 bucks right there. 65 plus 25, 75, 85, it's 90 bucks. And then we got about maybe five, 10 bucks in paper and tape. And that is how you do a hundred dollar paint job. That's the breakdown, that's the cost. Let's put a mask on, let's get spraying. All right, so moving on to the first coat of paint. As you guys can see, we're holding the gun very far back, about 12 inches, and this is simply going to prevent, like I said, guys, solvent-related issues. You go hammer on that first coat super wet, that reducer is going to eat right through, you know, possibly your primer edges and things like that and give you all kinds of halos and solvent-related issues like crow's feet, all kinds of messes. I'm trying to get this job done pretty quick, so here, you know, I'm walking the gun up and down the car, whole way up, whole way down, fender to quarter panel, worked out pretty nice another tip i'm going to give you guys if you're not going to seal the car and you're going to attempt to do it the way i'm doing it you know just missing that first coat on use a slow or extra slow reducer if you miss your first coat on and you use a medium or a fast reducer it can leave you with a nasty orange peel that you are going to ultimately have to sand out before you clear um, and as you guys can see the first coat of base on that trunk looked like it was going to set up really nasty and looked all orange peely. Look at it now. Nice, flat, smooth. It actually almost already looks clear coated. Um, so that works, works out really good when you do it like that. guys have it 100 hour paint job came out nice no body work on this one we did a little bit of like mild primer work on the hood because it was like really bad and we only got a little bit better than what it was you could definitely still see some imperfections in the hood but um we did smooth it out rest of the car we smoothed out pretty good just sanding and i gotta tell you the smr 1150 for 65 bucks for 1.25 sprayable gallons you cannot beat this product only did two wet coats of clear on this car the first coat was like medium wet the second coat i went really really wet and i mean this is the finish we got guys it's about three coats of base 
So I just want to show you guys the results you guys can get for 100 bucks worth of material. So really, really not bad for the money. If you guys are looking for the best, most affordable auto body products in the world, head on over to www.speedocoat.com. They got everything you need to get your projects done. Like, subscribe, new videos every week.